himself. It did his body good. Oh, gosh. It's a trap, guys. <gasps> oh, no. This isn't going to be good. Uh-oh. He's going to him. I have a bad feeling about this. Hey, guys. Welcome back. I'm Dana, and today we're watching Solo Leveling Episode 5. Guys, I absolutely love it every single thing about this show so far. Jinwoo is getting strong. He is getting strong, getting strong, and he's getting his confidence and helping out and like actually defeating things. And it just makes me so happy to see it because he was so weak before. So I love to see the glow up. I love to see the grow up. I love to see the power up. I love to see all the up, up, ups, but for real, it's amazing to see and I'm excited to just continue along this journey as I said in the last episode I do think that this poster is actually showing us his growth from him as a weak guy but determined to a strong and powerful guy that is stepping on his past self so I'm excited to see him continue to, to level up in the show I think this episode is going to of course be more of that he's gonna be fighting more people but I also think the girl it, from the last episode the healer girl she's gonna also show up and they're gonna have some kind of interaction you know she's got a little thing for him and I think I don't know if he has a thing for her so I think that's what's gonna happen in this episode I do think somewhere along the line though his father is gonna come into play i think he just said like his father's not in the picture so he's not so he could be alive he could not be he could be super powerful or who knows what i have a feeling this guy at the top that might be him or that is the person that is in charge of this whole system but maybe it's his dad and maybe that's why he was chosen but i don't know i don't know maybe not but i guess the only way to figure out is to actually start watching this episode so are you guys ready to watch solo leveling episode five with me because i'm so excited to watch it with you guys i just love this show and actually one of you guys comment down i'm sorry we're not starting yet but one of you guys actually commented down below that this is only still the prologue of the show guys it gets more crazy it gets more intense i love it and i'm so excited for more of it so let's get into it starting now You saw the hottie. Oh, dang. Look at him. His body is ridiculous. His body is ridiculous. He kind of does lean towards cute. Yeah, look at him getting ripped. And then he takes his shirt off. It's like, damn. He didn't really stand out much at first. Apparently, he started exercising, though, and it did his body good. It did his body good. <laughs> <gasps> She's blushing. She's like, oh my. And he's dripping wet. She's trying not to peek. Was he always this hot? I mean, surely. Was he always this hot? Do you need something from me? Oh, yes. I just came to see how you're feeling since you're being discharged today. I'm honestly feeling pretty good. That's wonderful. Stop by reception whenever you're ready and we'll get your paperwork. <laughs> sure. Thank you. Yeah, he seems like he's already matured so much. Like, his face looks older. Oh, and oh, what? If it's all right, may I have your phone number before you go? You want my phone number? He's probably never had a girl uh, hit on him before. Must have a test result or two they still need to send me. Yeah, that's not a problem. <laughs> he didn't even consider like oh no she she likes me like she wants my number he's like oh no just test results <laughs> all righty here we go news ultra morning hello and good morning hello and good morning everyone a very special guest i'm yun ho beck and i run the white yun ho beck white tiger guild in the entire country i imagine your schedule stays pretty full dang he's a big guy Apart from talk show appearances and gate exploration, what exactly is a hunter's life like? Busy, for sure. Busy, Lots for sure. Lots of Hunters training. Are gifted, but far from perfect. Getting out of touch with the feel of combat and dull our instincts, no matter how enhanced they are. Mm. So you that makes sense. Day. That must be exhausting. <laughs> in my case, no. In Before my I case, no. I was a firefighter, so staying in good shape. I was a firefighter. Oh, okay. My comrades' lives are at stake. Not being at my best could mean the worst. Could mean the worst. Very likable guy. Hey, Jinu. Good morning, 
Regina. Oh, what? You're already up. I've been awake a while now. Have fun at school. Have fun at school. She's like, wait a minute. Look at those abs. Okay, so have you been working out? <laughs> a little bit. Yeah, a little. You also look a lot taller, which is weird. Abs I can understand, but height? It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. Yeah, he's like a whole new guy. His voice sounds a little deeper. Hey, hey. Don't forget an umbrella. No, that's heavy, and it's so nice out. It's better to be safe than sorry. All right. All right. It's probably going to start pouring. Careful out there. Careful out there. Yeah, his voice changed from the last episode, too. Like, he went through puberty. I'll save the running for later. Man, I really am jacked. Don't forget you're running. But I could become a bodybuilder if I keep investing points in strength. <laughs> Oh, yeah, because the strength points help, oh, too. Got some points to divvy up. Wolf Assassin. That is the question. Uh, your weakest one. That's always the hardest part of those kinds of games, trying to figure out where to allocate everything, too. Okay, I've got it. That looks good. That looks good. He's going to forget to do his running. I'm so sorry. I take it you're calling to ask about the rent, right? Right. Still waiting on this month's payment. Mm, he needs some money. Money's tight. No need. I'll, I'll send it right away. I'll send it right away. I'll keep an eye out then. You take care of yourself now, young man. I will. Does he have a big, fat bank account? I don't know if this change I'm going through is a reawakening or what. But now that I'm able to slay goblins without almost dying, mm -hmm. making rent shouldn't be too hard. Hopefully. That said, it won't exactly be easy either. Ah, yeah, line, going on the dungeon raids. Money, have to go through higher ranked gates. Trouble with that is no sane person will let a knee rank hunter just cruise in those. That's true. Maybe I'll get reevaluated. Mm, that could be smart, yeah. Better gates and make some extra cash just for the publicity. Uh, I might get too much publicity though. Mm. The awakenings are newsworthy as it is. But a hunter who can level up and get stronger by the day? That's unheard of. Yeah. I can practically see Don't want too much attention. Mm-hmm. And the nail that sticks out gets hammered down. Oof. No. That's true. I think it'd be for the best. It's sad that that's the case, but yeah. Until I have a solid grasp on this power. Great job to this voice actor, though, that he was able to switch it up, but keep it the same. You know, like, really mature his voice. Great job. Confirm. Hey there. <laughs> hey, his old uh, party, right? The name's Don oh no. His new party. My bad. Yes, sir. Oh hey, you're him, the dude that's like known for being horrible. <laughs> the weakest hunter of all mankind. The weakest hunter of all mankind. Dang. They're so mean. <laughs> Why would you say that to someone when you first see them? Like, oh, hey, I've heard you're kind of the worst. Be an issue? Not as far as I'm concerned. We need you to meet the quota, and that's more important than your rank. Yeah, it's more important than your rank. over the phone, but you're mainly here for the head count since we need a minimum of eight hunters to enter a C rank dungeon. Half the party has to Where's the eighth be person? But we've got that covered. You they only have seven people right there. there. So we won't be sharing any of the spoils with you. Oh, get your two million dang. Participating, though. Two million. How much money is that? Four C ranks. Alexa, two how much is two million won to so. USD? You'll be in charge of all in our bags. We've got food, spare clothing, gear. First aid gets somewhere in there too. First aid. I didn't say yes. I said won, but it's thirteen thousand. Independent parties like ours have a hard time retaining healers, as I'm sure you can imagine. We do all our raids without a healer, so we're used to it. Just sign on the dotted line and we can be on our way. Just sign on the dotted line. You should read it first. Recognize the party is not liable for anything. Recruit. My name's Gene Ho Yu. I'm a 21-year-old dealer. Aw, he's cute. Signed up as a quota guy, just like you. Sign up as a quota guy, just like you. Oh. Look at his... He must be rich. Yeah. It's your first C-rank raid ever? <laughs> Don't you worry. I'll be there to keep you safe. Don't you worry. Awesome. He's like, yeah. I don't need you, baby. Those bags look really heavy. Think that you'll be okay? Yes. He's like this? Oh, come on, bro. This is nothing. Just drop all the please and thank yous. 
trembling without reading the moon again. For some strange reason, I've never been great at picking up on social cues. Mm. <laughs> That's all right. Maybe one day you'll learn. One huge swirly light. We really don't, which makes me feel like it should be ranked higher. You know what I mean, boss? The association folks said it was a Seagate. How do they rank it? Do they go in first and then come back out? The magic power within is what counts, and I think we'll be just fine. When Mr. Hong said they checked it, he meant they measured its magic. I see. Hey, he answered my question. I may be an E-rank, but I have been doing this a while. I have been doing this a while. It's still your first C-rank raid. Yeah, that's true. He's got some nice gear for real. Oh, nice. Well, That's not a little light. I hear them. They found us. They just haven't shown themselves yet. Mm. Ready? Yes. Ready. What moves as a group lives in the dark, but is drawn to light when they sense it. Mm -hmm. uh, we're dealing with insect types. Insect damage. No wonder it's dark. What do you mm. see there, boss? Bunch of nothing. They're hiding. Don't tell me it's an ant colony. Great. They went oh, it's gonna be I'm those giant awesome. ants. From the first episode. Dang, that's a lot. Oh, gosh. He's like, I do not need you, baby. I do not need you. I'm going to have to save you. Wow. They're impressive. All right, Jinu, do something. Nice, okay. All right. They're actually pretty good. A lot better than his previous group. Yeah, they do work well together. Since they operate without a healer, they're a little too aggressive. Interesting. This fancy gear makes up for his lack of skill. Thank you. fine, I guess. But... With his foot. Yeah, there's gonna be something much bigger in there. That's the last of the ants, but there's something else. Just you wait. We're done here, you guys. It's looting time. Not yet. Yes, sir. By seven? Surely it should be eight, because if you're doing it by the weakest, there's two weak people there. Weak people. I could sense him. <laughs> then your it's instincts deep. are very sharp. Beat me dead. What could be big enough to prey on these? I mean, those. I guess they are kind of big. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you're right. They were a gift from my dad. He mm. wanted to honor my first raid and all. Oh, this first raid. Sure to watch your back. They get the sense we'll need to. Hmm. He does not trust them. Just make sure to watch your back. Okay. From what? The Guildmaster training. Dang. He is ripped. Wow. Okay. Get a cleanup crew in here. Mm. All right. I want to watch him fight some more. And the size of a dungeon has nothing, nothing to, do. to do with its rank, right? I yeah. was listening when you talked about magic power ratings. Are they eating lunch? This dungeon is fast, but mostly empty. Sure does. Sure does. It must be hard lugging around all that stuff in this huge place. Really, bro. I don't mind. He's been working on his back, really so he's good. This doesn't it's weigh like anything. Without fighting magic beasts. <laughs> oh yeah, because he's the only person that's not supposed to fight at all. Mm. 
untested party without a healer. And they needed extra members. Because they've killed somebody. Dead one. <laughs> nice. Thanks. I feel like they've probably done some things to the rest of their party. Or they've made a lot of foolish decisions. Mm, spider webs. To the boss Stay alert. Oh, dang. What's oh, trapped inside of there? It's some more ants. No way. It's not going to be that easy. Oh, it's a trap, guys. It's got to be worth billions, if not more. Mm mm. Don't touch him. It's gonna be like an Indiana Jones movie. You move it, and that's when all breaks loose. Mm. Is he the brother of that redhead guy, the firefighter, white guild guy? Uh oh, he's gonna by him. Beast. Shouldn't this particular find be split eight ways instead of seven? Well, of course. Let's split it all evenly. Fair is fair, after all. Oh no, this isn't First, gonna be good. There's some company we should see to. Ah, the dungeon boss. In case you didn't know, rookie, the gate will close okay. once that thing dies. Mining and carrying out this truckload of crystals comes before exterminating the colossal spider. Fortunately, it seems to be asleep. Which gives us the perfect chance to excavate. Interesting. So, where's the gear? I mean, I wasn't expecting there to be a treasure trove of modern crystals. I left all of the transport and mining tools back with my ride. Chulty, don't I always say be prepared for anything? I'm really sorry. Guess it can't be helped now. Why don't you two stay here for a bit and protect our prize? We'll go get the mining equipment. I have a bad <laughs> feeling about this. We have the lowest ranks. You'll be just fine. Yeah, because why wouldn't they send? I doubt anything could snap it awake unless you did it intentionally. Yeah, because then why wouldn't they send them back if that was the case? Because they're stronger. He's lucky Jin who's there. Yeah, so they're all used to it. Suggest they've taken on a fair share of C rank dungeons before this one. So why mm. recruit Gino on me instead of having regular temps on call? Because they're all that's right. their sacrifice. Go ahead and seal off the entrance to the lair if you want. <laughs> yeah, I knew these these guys were no, no. bad news. Considering the timing, I think they just betrayed us. You think? Hunter's line at work. You run into some real crooks. Our job will always have some risk. Mistakes and accidents are bound to happen. But since those accidents occur inside gates, it's easy for anyone with ill intent to commit a crime and then never see their offense come to light. Mm, it's not yeah. like there are surveillance cameras in there. And without Dang. living witnesses, there's zero evidence. Sometimes Dang. People but bait to lure out the magic beasts or to get left behind. But what for though? Like, but what's the point? That's what I don't understand. Why? No, you would have still been in there. We were were ready to strike us down on the spot after one wrong move. Mm-hmm. More importantly, baby's awake now. I love him. He's so sweet. No. No, start fighting this thing and you destroy it. You got this, Jinu. You are strong enough now. That's all right. You got it. You got it. Oh, wow. It's huge. 
You got this. I have faith in him. And he's gonna level up like boom, 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 no. boom, boom. I take that back. Do you know? Don't move. I'm gonna fight this thing. Wait. He looks like a Shinigami, Shinigami with his tongue. <laughs> I mean, this one's mine. Okay. I will say um, it was kind of a more like a slower episode, but that was a great episode. And I really like the, I don't remember his name, but the guy with the armor and everything. I love how he he's like instantly on Jinu's side. Like, I mean, he just met him and he was like, okay, um, don't worry, no matter what happens, I'll protect you. I've got your back. I'm here for you. Like, let me see your contract. Let me make sure like you're getting paid too. And you're, it's all fair for you too. Like what a great guy. Like he has such a good heart and I love to see it. What's up with these other guys though? What is their, their goal here? Because they must've already found the bigger loot because if this was the extent of the loot, they would like, they, they wouldn't lock them in there to not get it right so they must have found already the bigger mana and stuff obviously they do this a lot but like for what reason surely they're not gaining that much more money like they would have just had to split it between two more people and one of them wasn't even gonna get anything so and one the other one is already rich obviously so he didn't he, they could have probably talked him out of it so like I don't know. I, I don't think it needed to be that serious, but we'll see. I'm excited for the next episode because I cannot wait to watch him fight. I can't wait to watch him fight this thing. I know he's going to destroy it. And the other guy's going to be like, how? You're E. That's a C. How? <laughs> I know it's going to be a great battle. And then how is he going to seek revenge on those guys or at least just get justice for him and his new friend i hope his new friend stays alive and joins his party and they get to go on new dungeon raids together and ultimately i hope he ends up getting enough money so he can pay his rent for him and his sister i don't know but i guess the only way to find out is to continue watching and the only way to do that is to make sure you like and subscribe so you know when the next one comes out from me Alrighty, guys i am having so much fun if you guys are not liking the vibes of this show don't worry because i upload a new video of a new show every single day Alrighty, guys i i'm having so much fun i can't wait to see you back here next time bye